for staying with us once again and joining us on this channel sports 7 gh it's always a great great pleasure to have you join us thank you very much for staying now in this video we are going to look at tomorrow there is uefa super cup coming on involving real madrid and atlanta atlanta won the uefa europa league and real madrid won the uefa champions league it is the first game for kelly and mbappe now there is a ghanaian element in that particular final that is coming on a ghanaian player is likely to play for atlanta and we are going to give you the details about that in this particular video who is winning the game how would the game go that Ghanaian element you know how is it going for 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 the player we are going to look at all of that in this video jose marino and alexander jiku um gets kicked out of the uefa champions league qualifiers yes by leo <laughs> unfortunately they are eliminated from the uefa champions league and they qualify to the europa league automatically they are going to play in the uefa europa league this season so that's the situation of alexander jiku we are going to give you more details and then also we will look at patrick Pfeiffer news and then some other news um and black stars player played a game today you are going to look at how he performed in this video do want to subscribe to the channel like this video hit the notification bell and select or leave your thoughts and comments below in the comment section if you have any it's always a great great pleasure to have you join us thank you very much for staying today there was a uefa champions league qualifying game on um involving fenabachi and then leo jose morino's fenabachi now they drew the game one one um after the game traveled to extra time and leo um got the <laughs> after in fact fenabachi scored the first goal okay 90 plus one minute and then the game traveled to extra time they were defending Jose Mourinho and Fenerbahce, crack, 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 they defend. In fact, throughout the game, they defended resolutely. Um, Alexander Jigo and his defenders, you know, they tried very well to ensure that they will eliminate Leo. But Leo couldn't um, get eliminated as they pulled one back um, in the 11, one, 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 eight minutes. Um, yes, <laughs> so they pulled one back and the game ended in 1-1. One, one. So Leo have qualified to the next round of the competition with a 3-2 uh, uh, um, aggregate okay so they are 3-2 aggregate and they've qualified to the next round of the uefa champions league qualifiers fenabachi they've been eliminated from the uefa champions league. so we will not see jose Mourinho and fenabachi in the uefa champions league but we are going to be seeing him in the europa league playing with fenabachi can he win it with fenabachi he won the uefa champions league with porto won it with um inter milan won it with um no he won europa league with manchester united and won um, um conference league with roma so will he be able to win the UA, um, uefa europa league with 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 fenabachi um that will also ensure that alexander jiku will be winning that particular trophy <laughs> i think it will be a very very difficult one but let's see how things go uh, alexander alexander jiku played the entire game he was very solid resolute at the back having some number of clearances and interceptions he intercepted one bobby that was likely to score but he intercepted the boy the boy didn't score indeed you you would understand why jose moreno really likes alexander jiku um to be in his game so that's the situation with jose moreno and fenabachi over there as i speak to you patrick pfeiffer is a black stars player now the news reaching us is that he's undergoing medicals um as he goes on loan to young boys um that is in sweet zaland young boys and um, that's where patrick pfeiffer is going on loan now you know that he's a player for fc augsburg within the week i was telling you, i think last weekend or so i was telling you that he's looking to move from augsburg to another team and there were interest from some german bundesliga clubs um but it looks like he has moved from german bundesliga to sweet zaland now young boys <laughs> young boys plays in the champions league yes they will play in the champions league so um you see how things go for them over there all right so patrick pfeiffer doing medicals at young boys he uh, he virtually left augsburg because 
um because he he's not getting playing time he's not getting playing time as osbeck and he wants to play he wants to be part of the blaster squad and all of those issues so um we'll see how things go for patrick pfeiffer now tomorrow real madrid is playing versus atlanta in the uefa super cup the winners of the two european competitions the champions league for real madrid the europa league for atlanta they are going to play in the uefa super cup and um <laughs> so we will see who the who the champions of europe will be now there is this one player who is playing for atlanta now he moved from cagliari in the italian syria to atlanta also in the italian syria his name is ibrahim Sulemana. he made his um, he made a blaster squad for the friendly and um, for the games we played uh, um world cup qualifiers we played some months ago he made a score and ibrahim Sulemana. he has made the atlanta squad for that game versus real madrid so it is either he's going to start the game or play parts in the game or he will be on the bench or he will not make the first 18 of atlanta you know you can make the squad but the first 18 for the day you no, know, you may not make the squad um that squad to play the game so the good news is that he has first made the atlanta squad to travel to poland that's where the game is coming on um so that's ibrahim Sulemana in your shorts yes yes ibrahim Sulemana. we wish him all the best me i'm a barcelona fan so i'm wishing that atlanta will win the game and ibrahim Sulemana will get a very very good game and we will get the chance to what properly uh, watch ibrahim Sulemana over there so that's how things are he made a squad fantastic blasters player very very good news for him now let's move on Oh, another Black Stars player played for Nor Norwich City. Now, championship, the Amaza, you play games with championship. You go play games. Sah. Last weekend or this weekend, they played game. Uh, they played a game and then today to Norwich City have played versus Stevenage. Now, uh, Forsen Abankwa played 61 minutes. He had 34 touches. He had 19 over 20 successful dribbles. Five ground duels won. Four ball recoveries. Three over four successful dribbles. Um, 19 over 20 successful passes. And then three over four successful dribbles. Two over two long passes completed. Two fouls won. One assist. He had an assist in his first start for Norwich City. You know that he got transferred from Salzburg to Norwich City um, just some few days ago and he has started doing very well for them he's a black stars player has played for the black stars during the match friendly games in them um, in the year 2024 and he's been he's been doing very well for salzburg before joining norwich city and it looks like he's having a very very good time at norwich city 61 minutes played <laughs> why the coach you no know, now only impressed this other because somebody with these uh, statistics in 61 minutes here i think that he should have played more minutes than that but that's the situation with forcing amankwa yes thank you very much for staying with us and joining us once again on this channel let me know your thoughts comments views opinions in the comment section of this video like the video hit the notification bell and select to i'll definitely see you in the next one bye